Good morning everybody, it is Sunday the 13th of August. I'm just going down for breakfast. I don't know why I look so red. I've got no idea why I'm looking so red. So I'm going down for breakfast. Jessie's gonna stay in the room and get ready. We're off to Washington today. Um, it's about quarter past nine at the moment. Uh, we need to be leaving here by quarter past 10. So I've only got about half hour for breakfast, but I'm gonna go down and show you what's for breakfast anyway. So we'll see you at breakfast. Something in the air, always something in the air. Inexplicable, I can feel it in the air. Can you feel me? Can you feel me? Breakfast. Ah. Oh. Breakfast. Ba 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 breakfast. There you I go. Like the Ready? Yeah. Oh my god, I love you. Oh. Oh. On the way down to breakfast, I said it was Sunday the thirteenth of August. Saturday. Now, when I was watching the news whilst having my breakfast. I saw it's Saturday, so apologies, it's Saturday the 13th of August. We've got about half an hour before we've got to leave. Because we've, we've got to get to a bus stop, then get a bus to Penn Station, so we can get the train, the Amtrak train to Washington. So, we could get an Uber, but it's a quite expensive, and walking is out of the question, it's a good half hour walk. Yeah. So, <laughs> so, we need to get uh, our stuff together and get ready to go so we'll see you probably next at the bus stop It's two dollars. Okay, oh, you, say, you say how much? Yeah. Oh, oh. For uh, all that? day in the UK. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So well, we only need one way, don't are we? Are you from Paris or London? London. I knew it. 
So we need the LM, which is Lime, Northwest Hospital route, and then it's going to take us only so far to Penn Station. Then it's about a three minute walk, but that is the closest we can get to it from this bus. So we are waiting because we believe this lady is on her break, this bus driver is on her break. So we'll just wait in for her to finish her break and then we can jump on to Northwest Hospital or somewhere on that line. And then it's a three minute, four minute walk to Penn Station, isn't it? About five minutes, yeah. Five minute walk. So five minutes. Now how long is the walk though? From Penn Station? Yeah, from three this. Minutes. Three minutes, yeah. Over a bridge, I think. Yeah, I think that's what she said, yeah. So yeah. And then we're really like an hour and early for our train. Yeah. So this is where you need to get the bus if you're staying in our hotel to Penn Station. Now I believe, what is this, what is this block? This is... Uh, we are on the corner of Eastern and St. Caroline. Eastern and St. Caroline Street. Thank you. Yeah, good work. Yeah. Go ahead, I'm ahead. It's going all over. I'm ahead. Go ahead. Yeah. Oh, thank you. Okay. Thank you so much. Are you sit there? Yeah. So what did she say? It's free. Huh. She's got to start the walk. Oh, we're bigger high five than that. Ooh. Mm -hmm. That's back in the pocket. Um, Washington bus. Yeah. Just kind of standing in the shade. No. That's a nice lady bus driver, wasn't yeah. it? Okay. So, turn that again. We're on Eastern so and Eastern Avenue. Yeah. On the corner of Saint Caroline Street. So, if you're staying in our hotel, what was it? About a two-minute walk. Yeah. From so Caroline Street, Eastern Ave. Yeah. So we're near the hospital, that's the hospital route. Yeah. And you get off the Preston Street and Charles Street. Yeah. And it's a four minute walk to the Penn Station. Can we, could we get a bus straight to Penn Station or is this the closest we can get from where we are? This is the bus that takes you straight there, otherwise you'd have to get two. Oh right, okay. So we are doing it the easiest yeah, way. Right, the okay. the easiest way. Otherwise we'd have a 15 minute walk on yeah. another bus that does go straight there. Yeah. And it is closer that way, but it takes 15 minute right, walk. Okay. We don't want that in the seat. No. This bus is nice and aircon, as you can see. She's not started a shift yet. She's still on our break for another two minutes, but she's let us on. And she waved us on for free. Yeah, which is really nice. <laughs> see, it always helps if you get pally with people, doesn't it? And be polite to them and yeah. ask them about their, how they're feeling, what they're up to today, tell them where we're from. You know, get talking to them, because you never Fill know. Fill them with kindness. Yeah, fill them with kindness. Obviously, we don't expect things. No, we didn't expect to get it for free. Obviously, it keeps happening. Yeah. So, thank you. Yeah. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thanks. What a lovely lady she was, yeah? Very helpful. So, how long have we got to walk down here now, then? Well, what, did, what did the lady say? Uh, one second. Just keep going. She said a five minute walk, I think, didn't she? I only caught half of the conversation. Yeah. yeah. And that was 14 yeah. stops, wasn't it? Yeah. Yeah. So, about a three minute walk from where we got dropped off on the bus, we're at Baltimore, Pennsylvania station. That was easy, wasn't it? Uh, I th I don't think we can. I think you've got to go on. I think when I booked the original tickets for the tenth or the eleventh, it says you cannot get any other train. But yeah, well we can ask. Let's just ask if we, if we can get the early one, then we will. But let's just ask. sort of say. But as far as I'm a, as I remember, you had to book the train that you are uh, paid for. Oh, so you had to go on the train that you paid for. But we'll find out. I just want to get the hours. Oh, they've got a Dunkin. They've got a Dunkin. I'm just going to go and show people what they've got in here.
So our train is the 11.54 to Washington. You'll see it just there, the 11.54. But Jess is currently asking to see if we can get an earlier train because we've got about 55 minutes wait, but we'll see. So Jess has just asked if we could swap that train for another one because we've got about 55 minutes to wait. Unfortunately, this is the next one. We missed one by two minutes, so we have to wait for the next one, which is fine. We just go and get a drink somewhere, maybe even go to Dunkin' and get a brew or something. But yeah, so we've got about 55 minutes to wait. So we're probably gonna camp up on those seats behind us with a drink or something and just wait. I'm sure it'll go quite quickly. Jess has got to call your dad, haven't you, anyway? Yeah, we've got some family just yeah. to check on them okay. Yeah, so yeah, that would take a bit of time. So yeah, we hopefully we'll see you next on the train. So our train is now boarding and we have to go to Six. So let's get on the train. The yeah, I just got it on cam just to show people. Yeah. So for anyone that don't know, I went to put my drink in the bin two or three minutes ago, and I noticed like a little handbag in the bin. So we just notified uh, um, what was it ticket and information desk, didn't we? And they're going to go and assess it. It could be a mistake. It could be someone that's definitely throwing it away deliberately, but we didn't want to do anything that we didn't want to do. Yeah, this one's going to White Marsh as well first. Oh, so this is... Yeah. I'm showing my ticket. Yeah, the ticket inspector comes on. We're on A, platform A we are. Yeah, but it says A on the screen. So we're just on the platform now. So I'm just gonna repeat what I said because I'm not sure if it came out properly. So I went to put my cup of tea in the bin because we was bored in. And I know it's like a little love heart bag. Now it looked like some little clutch bag or something. So I told Jess, Jess went to have a look and said, yeah, it's a little clutch bag. So we informed the ticket office and information desk just to say that there's a bag in the bin. We're not entirely sure if it's a mistake or someone's done it deliberately, but we thought if that is a mistake and someone's left their money or passport or keys or whatever in that bag, they're gonna be devastated. So we told them just as we're about to board, they said they're gonna investigate it. So hopefully if it is your bag, they've got it and they've and you've uh, we saved you from a big dilemma if it's been in there and it's empty and it's deliberately put in there then we're sorry for an inconvenience but we thought we'd best say something just in case Yeah. 
Somewhere to eat and somewhere to camp up. Yeah, well, McDonald's is down there, so it was last time. Mackies. I had Mackies last night. Pot belly. Pot I just need to sit somewhere and get the, get the game loaded. So. Where's McDonald's and pot belly down here? Well, McDonald's was down here last time, from what I remember. Okay. But I could be wrong. But I oh. swear McDonald's is this way. Bar. Come all the way to Washington, sit for an hour now, and watch the Lumen Man United game. Mm -hmm. <laughs> what, Pratt? Yeah. I think it's here. It's the other way, I think. I could be wrong. You are wrong. Unless it's not here anymore. No, we checked the website, didn't we? Definitely here. I can ask someone, I'll go Yeah, go and ask someone. <laughs> Again, actually. That food last night was awful. Yeah, it was all dried up, wasn't it? And like horrible. And I think we just got too tired, didn't we? In the end, we did. One already. Yeah. I think in the end, we got so tired last night that we wasn't hungry no more, was we? Off, yeah. But we had to eat it because we paid so much for it. Yeah. But this, this one's going to be fresh. Yep. That's uh, freezing. Mm. Shops and cafes. Yeah. Golden Arches. Yeah. I might go and sit up here. Here? No. No? I think this one's nice, it's in the shade as well. Yep. Yep. What do you want? Dr. Pepper, Fanta Orange. Fanta Orange. Fanta Orange. Yep. There's mayonnaise in there and small Brilliant. Sauce. So I've got, got my Happy Meal? Yeah, I've got, you've got your extra fries instead of like apple slices. Oh, okay, brilliant. Yeah. Uh, yep, thank you. We'll give this to a little kid, won't we? I'm sure someone will want it. Is that right? One of those Something like that, yeah. Mm. Yeah, it's like a sausage roll. Yeah. 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 Enjoy your food. I oh, am. Yeah. So we're just leaving McDonald's now. We was in there for about an hour. I managed to get some food and managed to catch the second half of the Man United game. What an absolute shit show that was. Uh, less to say about that, the better. I'm fuming, I'm angry. It's just not the club that it used to be. I don't know what's going on. It's rotten from the core. In from the core. Um, yeah, let's just say about that. The better. So we are currently now going to navigate the station, uh, Washington Union Station, to get to the zoo. Uh, we've got to find the metro station. Now I'm not entirely sure what station it is we've got to get off at, but when we do get off, it's about an 11-minute walk. Here's Jess coming out to it. So what station is it, Metro Station? Woodley Park Zoo on the Shady Grove line, the yeah. red line, and I in, think. And then when we get off, what, how long the walk is it? 11 minutes, 11 12 minutes. minutes. Yeah. 11, 12 minutes, right. Can I see some pandies? Yes, pandas, yeah, we want to look some pandas. I've got like this leafy t-shirt on, so I'm hoping the, the herbivores... Like bite out of him. I'm like, I'm like, I'm, hope, I'm hoping the herbivores don't see this as food and eat me. I hope they do, so I can spend the next day on my own. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, so yeah, we've got to find the metro station. We're going to do that now. I think it's, not entirely sure where. Um, now, as I remember, the ticket machines at Washington are quite hard to navigate, aren't I they? I remember. So when we were here about 12 years ago, they're not easy like most stations are. It's very hard to navigate. So hopefully they've changed them by now, hoping. Hopefully. Otherwise it's going to take us another 10 minutes to try and figure <laughs> out how to get a ticket. But anyway, you'll see us next at these dreaded ticket machines. Yep. So I guess it's B. 
value, I guess, isn't it? Or it's eight, oh no. That's not right. Pass. No, not that either. Oh, it's two dollars for the card, okay. Sense to me. It says two dollars per trip. Unless you've got to pay two dollars for. No, look, each rider, five years old, and have a smart card. We can pay two dollars per trip. Just pay with the twenty. Yeah. So what change you get? Ten dollars, but where's the other part? It's a sea station manager. Topped up then. You've yeah. got to get a couple of journeys today anyway. Yeah. So it's still awkward to use as ever. We don't understand it, it's just so difficult. I don't know why, but we managed to get a ticket each anyway now. We tried to go on one, we tried to go through all one ticket, didn't we, to save money. But you have to have a ticket each. It's very strange, I don't understand it. No one explained it to us, but anyway. We've got the tickets now that we need. We're at Shady Grove. No, we're not. We're at Union Station on the Shady Grove line, which is a red line. And the next stop is where we're going to Woodley. Woodley something. I can't remember the name now. I'll have a look on the map in a second. Uh, we're coming up to it now, actually. I'll show you now. We are here. We've got one, two, three, four, five, six stops to Woodley Park. And then it's about 11 minute walk then, isn't it, from yeah. there? So. We'll get there at some point, yeah? So tired. Yeah. <laughs> but those machines are so awkward, aren't they? I just I don't, don't think they are unless they explain how to do it. Yeah, it, no, but any other machine is simple, mm -hmm. isn't it? But those are so complicated. I don't know, innit? It's just... It's just for $2 a no, day. No, it's, it's a good journey, but it's just, it's just a weird weird way of doing it on those machines. Way. But you yeah. have to mine us off what you want. Yeah. So it tells you to put in... It was my fault, so it said it was $10. I just needed to minus it down to 2 Yeah charge me for yeah. I've got an extra like three journeys now to so yeah. make one journey back yeah and then possibly another one but if not I'll just give it to a homeless person yeah I'm not it's so it. awkward anyway but anyway we've got one two three four five six seven stops and then it's a few minutes walk from there Isn't the Pond Circle near where we're going like the I've got no idea <laughs> we'll figure it out yeah we'll, we'll figure it out sorry. yeah <laughs> yeah we it's been, been here in like ten years no eight years no, we've come to Washington at 2012. We've been to Washington Airport, but we've never been on the metro in Washington, have we, since? We have. We came with Matt in 2013. Yes, we did. Yes, we did. We did. We've done a day trip here, yeah. didn't we? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> well, it's a good eight, nine years yeah, anyway. Eight, yeah. Nine years. <laughs> but yeah, anyway. And we're very tired. We're very tired. We're very full sore. Of burgers and full ice cream. Of, yeah. We, full did, of... we had ice cream, by the way, and Wayne had another two burgers. Yes, that was off cam. We didn't want to. Yeah. We didn't want to. Um, stuff our faces too much did we on and cam yeah we're probably only gonna have about an hour two and a half hours now which is fine probably we've got a free ticket so far really yeah it's yeah. free for everyone by the way yeah you just gotta order it 30 days before you well you can order it in between 30 days before your date yeah. you want to go can't it's like you we booked it two days ago yeah right let's go to see the animals mm -hmm.
that makes sense. Like, I kind of can handle it. I'm you know, used to that. Some people are used to that. Yeah, it is It picked up, it might have done, I don't know. Oh, Jeez. That I need hands to hold on to this one. Please be careful. I will. That is crazy. Yeah. It's usually going to be short by the time we get up there. We should be at the zoo for around half three. Yeah, it's a bit blurry at the moment. Is it three? Half past three, we should be there. Yes, 3.17, isn't um, it? And that'll give us a good two and a half hours. Yeah. And then I think we're just going to head towards, like... All the landmarks. Yeah, we're just going to head to the Lincoln Memorial, the Washington Monument, the White House, and the Capitol Building, depending on how safe it is and if there's any nuts outside. That place, <laughs> there's that place near the Lincoln Memorial, and that, you know that long, big, like, pond or whatever it is? There's that place with all those states. Do you remember? There's that place where you can sit down there's all those the all the state no it's, a, the, it's from the Lincoln Memorial all the way yeah, to whatever. London. I don't know if it's called the Mall. I don't know no that's London oh is it <laughs> but there's a place where you can see all the states Lincoln Park I don't know what it is but I'm, we're gonna go there as well aren't we yeah well yeah. that's the walk we're gonna take up to the White House yeah. isn't it yeah and if we've got time maybe a quick look in one of the museums maybe yeah we'll just see maybe the Smithsonian well that is all the museums isn't it oh no but like maybe the Space Museum maybe we'll see yeah we'll see Thank you. Thank you. Yep. Yeah, thank you so much. Thank you so much. Thank, thank you. you. Oh, what a really nice guy. Yep. Yeah. We're really bad. We ain't got no change or anything, have we, really? But I don't like giving change because people want to use it for like recreation. Mm. I'll buy him a sandwich or something. But yeah. He seems quite happy standing there. Yep. Oh. Right, anyway, let's go and see some animals. Yeah. <laughs> there was a guy there on a bike with like a Bluetooth speaker and he was like her delivery driver for food. And it just makes me laugh just because people are just minding their own business. And I thought I could do that. Mm. Quite happily just listen to my music in this gorgeous weather. But saying that now he probably travels miles, doesn't he, probably. delivering our food. Yeah. yeah, so we're, as you saw, out on the station now and on the street. We've got about, this is Connecticut Avenue. We've it? got about 11 minute walk. Now I just want to tell you if anyone's asked, interested, so when we booked, uh, when, we, when we found out that was coming to summer camp, we booked our Amtrak tickets from Baltimore, Penn Station to Washington Union Square. And at the time we booked it for the 11th of August and it was $22. And that was a return trip. So it worked out about $5.50 each. When we got to camp, <laughs> we was told that we wasn't leaving camp until the 11th so which is fine which is fine we only based it on previous years and on previous years we left the date after the campers left but this year we left two days after the campers left so that means we missed our Washington train yeah so Jess called up and after about an hour trying to get through we managed to get a refund of $22 yeah so in a voucher yeah in a voucher like in a voucher code now when we move when we tried to rebook the train for today using the voucher code it just wouldn't go through would it no it just would not work so we had to pay forty dollars for today <laughs> but we booked it obviously three or four days ago so we it's booked worth it, it for you yeah. guys so it's still ten dollars each per way which is still not too bad for what it is no, really? it was about a 45 minute uh, train drive so the capital is brilliant yeah, 45 it? yes yeah, about 45 minute train drive oh uh, train drive train ride <laughs> and we had a table now we didn't pre-book any seats we just sat where we could get the first two seats and it just happened to be at a table with a nice lady I think she was a nurse, wasn't she? Yeah, she was a nurse. Yeah. 
So, a little bit tired. It's yeah, so we have got a voucher for $22 on Amtrak left to spend. So hopefully when we come back to winter camp which in December, are. which we are, yeah. it's been confirmed. We'll see if we can use that because we're thinking of maybe going to Philly, aren't we? Yes, we've never been to Philly. No, we've not yet. done Philly yet. So we're hoping that when we leave camp, we can maybe get the Amtrak. Oh, <laughs> we can get the Amtrak using that $22 voucher or put towards it anyway and go to Philly. Yeah. Now, the machines at the Metro, I know I've banging on about this quite a few times, <laughs> but I just can't get my head around it. They must be I know how to do it, I've just got no patience. <laughs> they must be easy to use because they've been here for years and people are using them all the time, so they must be easy. It's just that we haven't been here in so many years and I struggled last time I was here with them and I'm struggling now. From what I could see, yeah. it's two dollars a fare and two dollars for the card. Yeah. So when you put the button to select, it says like eight dollars you just press the arrow down to what how many rides you want to do so we should have just put the arrow down so i'm stuck with like eight dollars on a card yeah. now, aren't I? but anyway it like i said it must be easy to do because millions of people every year go through washington and they use it fine it's just maybe <laughs> me i've got no patience i'm not feeling too well we've still got covid brain as well and we're yeah we have long covid aren't we oh uh, well i've got my taste well i've never lost my taste i just can't smell anything at the moment and i'm uh, struggling to breathe yeah. a little and i've got a sore foot so maybe all that combined it's just made me got no patience or what i don't know but and me whacking you on the shoes yeah, with the bottle yeah. sorry but anyway i said it must be easy to use because millions of people use it every year but i just haven't got the patience for it and i just can't get me around it but anyway just a heads up the walk from the station to the zoo is slightly uphill so yeah just take your time i'm knackered as it yeah, is it's yeah i'm a little bit tired so we're going to put the camera away now yeah. well i'm still talking wasn't I? oh yeah go on, then. So, <laughs> yeah sorry. so i was saying so it's probably easy but for the fourth time sorry i'm trying to say this it's probably easy to use the machines millions of people use it all over the world uh, all over the year or well, throughout the year it's just i can't figure it out and it's too busy there's too many people tut in and huffing behind you and you're trying to figure it out you're trying to ask people for help and no one seems to want to help because they're all in a rush themselves but anyway if you come to washington just give yourself a few minutes to try and familiar with familiarize yourself with the machines on the metro because i just can't get me around them but i'm gonna go now because i'm panting for air it's really hot it's a little bit up here like just said and it's about an 11 minute walk so we've probably done about five already so when we you next see us if we're not dead by heat exhaustion <laughs> or uh walking complete lack of fitness yeah uh we will see some animals if not we'll be probably lying food yeah yeah right see you soon <laughs> it's pandemonium, that's what it is. Yep, if I can. Well, I think we have to get in the shade so we can see that a bit because it's just too glared. Yeah, that's better. Yeah, yep. you can add it to your Apple wallet as yep. well, but we're not going to bother. I just let film the QR code so they can literally pause the video. That's a good one. Yeah. The zoo crew. <laughs> yeah. Got one there? Yeah, uh, yeah, go on in. Wow. And it'll just show people what they are. Yeah, I'm having one of those with the orangutans. Let's have a look. <laughs> Very nice. Right, let's go. Nice and the bag check. Yeah. Yeah. We're good, thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much, thank you. Oh, I want that red panda top. <laughs> so, wait here a minute. Welcome to Smithsonian Zoo. I think that's what it's called. <laughs> oh, no. We just called it Washington DZ Zoo. DZ? DZ. <laughs>
Ready? Oh. Yep, pandas, here we come. So we've been at the zoo for about 20 minutes now. Every single enclosure is either shut <laughs> or the, the animal is either at home or under rock somewhere so we can't see anything. The first animal we've actually seen is the otters, isn't it? Which you're happy about, you've got no complaints about. rolling around on his back but in a log. <laughs> what I think is rather than me recording than going up to the actual uh, exhibit itself, what I think I'm gonna do is walk up to it, check to see if the animal's in there first, and if it is, then show you, because otherwise you're just gonna, this whole vlog's gonna be just of empty exhibits, isn't it? And, it, and us two moaning about the heat. <laughs> yeah, so what I'm gonna do is I think, go up to the actual exhibit, or what do you call it, cage? I don't wanna call it cage, but exhibit. yeah. See if the animal, enclosure. yeah, enclosure. See if the animal's there. If we can see it, then I'll turn the camera on and show you. Because otherwise, this vlog is just going to be full of empty exhibits and cages and enclosures, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. Which would be pointless. So yeah. But anyway, you happy you saw the otters, aren't you? Yeah. Even There's, they were lazing around, being boring. Yeah. Came with rocks and on their back, couldn't they? <laughs> well, in this heat, I don't blame them, do you? It's to be honest. So, it's so hot. hot even yeah. in the shade, it's like stifling. Hot. Yeah. Right. So we'll go around to the next bit now. I think we're going to go to. Please the... stay hydrated. Oh yeah. Wayne did film me filling it up, but for some reason the clip's gone. I don't know why. It's, just, gone? it's just not there. Oh, okay. All. So we'll film another one of us showing you how to do it. Yeah. Because we do need to encourage that you stay hydrated. Oh yeah. Because it's definitely. so hot. Yeah. But anyway, we're going to go next down there, aren't we? Yeah. Hopefully there'll be some toilets because we need a wee, don't we? <sighs> yeah. Yeah. Right. And I'm sticky. Yeah. Do you miss me at all? Do you think about the things we used to do? 